so when people ask me what I think of Imam Hussein or why I specifically commemorate his death is first of all because of the sacrifices he's given now what kind of sacrifices are we talking about um, the way he stood up for social justice it's unlike anything I've ever seen anyone has done except if they may be a prophet or an imam as well but the way he stood up for social justice sacrificing himself his friends his family his baby infant kid is quite something just for us to be able to be free and make free choices unfortunately we don't have anyone standing up for these for their rights or other people's rights in the same way mainly because and thank god we don't need to the sacrifice has already been done just like how for example christians believe that jesus was sacrificed for their sins they don't need to stand up the way jesus did or the way imam hussein did i believe that if we truly want to remember a hero not a superhero like spider-man and iron man just to celebrate some fictional characters let's look into real life and real history and what happened on this earth we've got many many idols and heroes that we can look up to and unfortunately a lot of idols that we shouldn't look up to but we do for me, my hero is Imam Hussein, the son of Imam Ali, who is the son-in-law and cousin of the Prophet. And if it wasn't for them, we'd live in a, in a world of chaos and, and injustice. They are the people who sacrifice themselves for us to be able to be free because who would live, who would want to live in a world where you are just captive? You want to be free. And that's why I commemorate Imam Hussein.